In this video, we will be talking about Federico Chiesa and analyzing his 2020-2021 season. The three main focuses in this video will be his finishing, dribbling, and passing. Starting off with his finishing, the three key points to his finishing comes with his space, technique, and composure. In the first clip, you see the space created in behind for him to run. As he understands this, he takes that space and drives into it, having an opportunity to finish. In the second clip, Ronaldo drags the defender out and creating space to finish that with technique and the top bins. In the third clip, the key with this finishing is his technique. Even with that small space, he takes the opportunity and he isn't scared to miss. Right again, he runs into that space in behind the defenders and placing it into the corner. Right here, he places it to Ronaldo and he sees the space in behind to make that run as he drives into the space, receiving the ball again and finishing it in the back of the net. In this clip right here, once again, he sees that little space he has and he has the technique to finish it. So he takes the opportunity and places it in the back of the net. Right here again, he creates a space between the defender. He sees the movement of the keeper and places it on the opposite side. Right again, the space in behind, he drives into it. He sees the option and he places it in the corner with his technique. And in the final clip, he is running in the space in the back pocket. Nobody's covering him and he has a technique to put it in the back of the net. The next aspect of Chiesa we will be covering is his dribbling. And that involves driving into space, being very aggressive, small touches, and his agility. In the first clip, we see the space in behind. Him being able to turn on that half turn and is aware of the center back's movement to take it into the space. The second clip, he has amazing awareness. He understands where the defender is moving and drives into that space and taking the opportunity once again. Right here, we see Chiesa understanding where the space is as he drives into that and is aggressive knowing that someone else is trying to cover that space. Right here, he understands the defender's movement, he takes it around and is composed and drives into it once again. Right here, his aggression, agility and movement comes all into play, passing by the player and getting to that space with an attacking opportunity. Right here, you notice his body movement. That is the key to deceiving the defender, his agility and speed to break past and drive into the space. Once again, his deceiving body movement catches the player off guard and that creates that small space for his speed and driving to drive into that area. Once again, small touches, very agile, quickly drives into to that space to get another opportunity forward. Once again, another opportunity to drive into that space, taking one to two touches, being very quick and agile to pass by the player, and you see his aggression coming into play right here. And in the final clip, small touches, very quick on his feet, and drives and beats him on the half turn. And the final part to his game that we will be discussing is his passing and that comes with his vision, timing and into the space. On the passing opportunity, he sees the player driving into the space and knows where he's going to come, plays that ball and has the vision. Right here, he sees the player running into that space, he has the technique to hit it across the box and place it in the back of the net. In this clip, once again, 
driving into that space, seeing two players running into the box and playing it in front of them so they can finish the opportunity. Right here, he has the vision to see the player, plays it in front of him so the player can drive with it. Once again, he has the vision and is aware of the, where the space is and where the player is as he plays the ball into that space and the opportunity is finished. Right here, he notices the player, plays into the space, and the timing is wonderful. Once again, he drives into that space, he sees the player and he times the pass perfectly for Ronaldo to run onto it and have an opportunity for the finish. And in the final clip, he sees the player making the run and he has the vision and times the ball to play in front of the attacker. And that's it for today. Hopefully you liked this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, share, comment, do all of that because you need to know we're only going to the top. Peace.